Hello everyone, welcome back to Final Fantasy 13, part 103. This part's not really a part because it's just me Christerimizing my character for the next 13 minutes. Yeah, seriously. Um, but I just want to show you how much CP I've gathered over me not using it at all. And I'm going to Christerimize everybody right now, upgrade them. I'm mainly focusing on Lightning, Hope, and Snow, like I said. But I'm going to uh, show you Vanille Fang and Zaz as well. So, uh, as you can see, uh, we beat Bartanalus and now we get an extra... Uh, we get an extra uh, layer for the main roles. So as you can see here, I'm, I'm upgrading Vanille. Like, like I said, I'm not focusing on Vanille's ass or Fang, but I'm showing you how much I've gathered over what I did, I guess. But yeah, uh, I believe I fully upgraded like, almost everyone's main roles. And I didn't think I was going to. I thought I was going to get maybe one at most, but I almost do it twice, which is fucking wow to me. Um... So yeah, I hope you enjoy me Christerimizing. I could not talk for the next 13 minutes, but I think that'd be kind of boring because I'm just doing this for 13 minutes. So I'm going to keep talking, I guess. Um, mainly about the Christerium. So um, maybe I'll talk about this in like in the next part or like like the next recordings. I actually stopped recording after I finished this part. And I you know, I mean, I, I went back later on. As, and as you can see, I finished, I, I fully maxed out that one and I still have a shitload of CP left. Um... So yeah, uh, after I Christerimized my characters, I stopped recording. Then I went on and I uh, Stone Rampage, and I got I got up to before I'm gonna re-record again. I finished up to missions 28, um, and I uh, and and 55. I got 28, and I got mission 55. I did not get up to 55. I finished mission 55 to get the growth egg. And what I did was, uh, like I said, you have to go to Araba, and you have to go to that Sea Stone mission where I told you before to go, or just look it up online. And uh, I, I got Vanille fully maxed. Uh, not fully maxed, but uh, I got her pretty far up. And uh, she learns Death, uh, which is in her Ravenger, I believe. No, 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 it's a Saboteur move. She learns Death. I don't think I got that already. I could have be. I wasn't paying attention, so. Um, yeah, you uh, you fight this thing called the Neochu, and all you do is just cast Death on him. That's the cheap way to kill him. Uh, I used Hope and Snow. Snow was my uh, Sentinel, because they take a lot, because we get a lot of damage uh from the those enemies and i used hope as a medic so and i and i just used vanille as the saboteur so for the past hour i was just using death constantly on the on the uh, neochu uh snow was uh defending us with, as a sentinel from the massive damages that they were doing to us and he actually covered up pretty well and in case snow got really drastically low in health i had hope as a medic and he had, and he's my best medic and i just kept having him heal us up 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 it took me about an hour to beat the Neochu, and once I killed him with death, I uh, just went to, like, Rentless Assault, and I just owned the other kids. Or, I owned the other enemies, so that was pretty cool. And I don't know what the fuck is up with Fang's deal, but, uh, as you can see, I have, like, 200 less CP than Vanille. I don't know what the fuck was up with that, but, yeah, uh, Fang's an asshole. She fucking always screws me over on, on the Cursarium, so. As you can see, I barely get, I barely even get into my second one. Which is unfortunate, but uh, yeah. Next up is Zaz. Zaz has the, has had the most CP out of everybody. Uh, I don't know why, but he has had the most. So um, yeah, Zaz is up next. He has what? Almost eight hundred, almost seven hundred fifty thousand CP. Fucking hell. Uh, I am happy that I grinded a lot. I like I said, I grinded to the point where I fully upgraded everything, my secondary roles to the most they could, and my main roles to the most they could. And pretty much, it was just me walking to the main, to walk, walking here for six hours. I was playing like the story for six hours, fighting everybody, and I was just, and at, at that point, I was just gaining CP, and I wasn't really grinding per se, because I was just, I, I, I was honestly just walking straight. Um, not to mention. Those two boss fights, the chicken at Tenjin's Tower, Dakara, whatever you call it, I got 33,000 CP, and not to mention Bartanus' 100,000 CP boost really helped me out. So, I actually thought that you could actually get the growth egg before you fight Bartanus, so I'm just like, oh my god, 200,000 CP, but you can't, which sucks. Um, yeah, yeah, you're gonna get the growth egg uh, after you beat uh, missions 1 through 14, and you have beaten uh, Bartanus the, the second time. And then you can unlock the Seed Stone mission, which sucks because I thought you could do it before, but whatever. Um, so yeah, Zaz, I think I get his secondary role or his main roles. I think I get the, this one right here, the uh, second one I'm doing. I think I get this one fully maxed and I use the rest on the, on the last main role of, of his. 
And, uh, yeah, Zaz and Hope are, like, opposite synergists. He, like, he learns all this shit that Hope learned in the very beginning of the game, and Hope learns all this shit that he learned at the very beginning of the game. Uh, speaking of which, I actually get haste here. Uh, when I go to Hope, I instantly go to synergist just to get haste. Um, cause I fucking need haste. So, uh, yeah, here I'm finishing up Zaz, and now the meat of the video is me upgrading my main characters, Snow, Hope, and Lightning. So, up next is Snow, right up, up, now, okay, now we're at Snow, he has 6,007, or 672,625, I go to his commando, or actually, right here, I'm actually checking out and seeing what I can upgrade, because I want to know what are the most important rules that I can upgrade, as you can see here, I'm just getting a bunch of health, uh, and magic, and, uh, strength upgrades and I go to Ravenger to see if, if I get anything special and I get you know Blizzarga or whatever you call it and Watera or Uraga or whatever and it's just mainly more health strength and magic upgrades and then I go to Sentinel to see anything if, if I get any more shit and it, again it's it's just more health uh, magic and uh, commando upgrades so I decide to go to Commando first because I'm training uh, my Snow and Strength. So Commando is probably the main thing you want to do. Not to mention there's a shitload of health crap you get here. So he's getting a crap load of Strength and a lot of health. Snow has the most health in the game. So you want to have him pretty high in health or uh, HP. So as you can see I'm just upgrading a bunch of shit of his. I think I... I think I get his, yeah, I definitely got his commando fully maxed. I might get the next roll fully maxed. I forget. I think I do. Uh, I actually forget which one I do. I'll, I'll just pause and see which one I go after. I think I go after either Sentinel or Ravager, obviously, since the, those are the only two that are left over. So, yeah, upgrade, 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 upgrade. He's getting, look at, just look how much more powerful I'm getting. It's crazy. Uh, it's fucking crazy, crazy, crazy. I think I do have enough for the next roll. So, I go up to, uh, which one do I do next? Dun dun. Wait, 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 wait. I gotta. Okay. Uh. Oh. 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 I might. Yeah. I think I. Nope. I don't do that. Ah. Oh, I know. Okay. I go to Sentinel. Um. I guess I went to Sentinel because it's just magic. It's just upgrades for your stats now. It's not really like an ability. And I actually I barely use uh Snow for Ravenger. I mainly use him for Sentinel and uh, Commando. So I guess going to Sentinel was a good idea because I'm just getting a bunch of health upgrades now and a bunch of strength upgrades and and some magic but I'm, like i said i'm focusing on strength and health and as you can see i'm, I'm over i'm a, his health is over nine thousand. his health is over nine thousand health nine thousand one hundred health to be exact one thousand nine nine thousand one hundred forty health actually uh actually even more now it's bigger and i actually skipped one i'm going over here just to get some health boom boom all that run out so he has a, he gained like two thousand hp so now i go to hope and i instantly go to synergist because i want haste Without a question of doubt, I can see haste. It's right fucking there. Uh, but I still go to check other uh, places just to see which ones I want after I get Synergist. But Synergist is first. Um, medic, we see what we get. Medic, I think Medic is just, you know, me yeah, Medic is just uh, upgrades. But there actually is one ability, Curaga, which is like better than Cura. I think it's here somewhere. There it is, Curaga or whatever it's called. And yeah, it is just a bunch of strength, magic, and... Uh, health upgrades and hope needs a lot of health upgrades he has barely any health like four thousand it's nothing but uh yeah then i just go I, I go to ravenger just to see it like i said just to see and i get like one of his attacks last resort which is really cool but it's like a really all the characters in the game have like a lot like, a, like an ultimate attack it really does nothing which is unfortunate i mean some do some they do a lot of damage when the opponents stagger but anyway i go to center just just because i want that fucking haste i need haste <laughs> um I don't go after it instantly because I know I'm going to get it anyway, so I just get everything. And, and that's such a dick move that, that they put two strengths to get haste. What a fucking asshole. Because I'm not training hope and strength at all. As you can see, his magic is drastically high. Yeah, look at that. I am like, why are you going after strength? Why well, want to get everything? So who fucking cares? Boom. More, more magic. More magic. More magic. And then I get something that I don't even know what the fuck it does. Um, more magic. Yeah, we're at 1800 so far. Get some health, baby. Look at that. More magic, which is very nice. And now I go to, uh, uh, medic. Yep. Just to get some, uh, just to get some, um, uh, upgrades. And I get Kiraga, whatever it's called. 
Yeah, I got like medic's cool because you, you you do get a lot of health from medic, and you get a lot of magic from medic because it's all magic. I mean, you you don't you don't get much strength because it's magic. Sorry if I'm stuttering a lot. My apologies. Boom, boom, boom. I go up to medic first because I'm cool, and then I go up to strength. Actually, no, no, no. I go up to medic because I want to get the most out of it, and then I go to strength. So yeah. Over 2,000 for hopes, uh, magic. That's crazy. So for landing, I check out her commando, and I see what she can get. She can get a lot of really awesome stat upgrades. That's pretty much it. That's all she gets for uh, commando. Uh, and then for Ravenger, um, she gets uh, an attack called, uh, what is oh yeah, Thundaga. That is an amazing attack. I definitely get that one. Army of One is actually my favorite special ability by the way, all the characters. It's kind of weak, but it's actually an awesome looking, so... And medic, uh, more just you know, more health upgrades, more stat upgrades, and more, uh, yeah, upgrades essentially. I don't know what the fuck that does, but uh, and this one I go up to her commando first, and then I go up to ravenger, I believe. Oh yeah, and then I, and then I I, I, I check her secondary roll, see what to see what she can even get. As you can see, you need a lot of CP to get this shit, the shell gun. And, uh, yeah. Okay, fine. I go up to Ravenger first. Sorry. But I do go up to Commando um, after that. But, yeah, I'm getting her Army of One because that's such a good attack. And Thundaga is an amazing attack. If if you get a preemptive strike, use Thundaga because it pretty much staggers everybody on the field. Because it's, like it's like a huge aerial attack. And it pretty much covers up the entire battlefield. So you can, all, you can probably instantly stagger everybody. Or at least get a good, you know, advantage on them. Thundaga is a fucking amazing staggering attack. It's and, and 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 even when they are staggered, just keep fucking casting Thundaga because you do so much damage. It's it's amazing. So yeah, um, just upgrading Lightning now, getting her stats upgraded. I love Lightning because her her evenly balanced. I'm really happy that that they made her character evenly balanced. Like I said, I'm making Snow my uh, strength guy, Hope is my magic guy, Lightning is my uh, balanced girl. Yeah, now I go to Commando. I know I go to Commando because I, re I remember this. Um, and I get her Commando upgraded. Like I said, I'm just checking out this stuff right now. See what I can get. And this is a bunch of health upgrades. Nothing much. Not, nothing too extreme. And Lightning, oh my gosh, she went at 6,000 health. Fuck, I have to go to Commando now. <laughs> um, I think I did it because her strength was actually drastically lower than her. That's my phone. Okay, anyway, back to the... Yeah, that was my phone. Blah, blah, blah. Anyway, I'm um, upgrading her commando now just to get her strength upgraded, which is funny because I get more magic than strength coming up. But anyway, boom, 40 strength. Boom, 20 strength. Boom, more 20 strength. And I'm still underneath, and I'm, and, and I'm still below. And I'm, I'm like, why the fuck am I getting more magic than strength right now if, if, if I'm in commando? Then I get more magic. What the fuck? Oh, 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 here's the strength. Boom, 30. Boom. Oh, I'm almost there. Oh, I'm surpassed. Awesome. Then I get some more health. We're almost at 7,000. We have, or we are over 7,000. Boom. Oh, oh, am I going to make it? Oh, I make it. I made it. Yeah, I made it. Yay. I fully upgraded too. I'm just like, holy shit. And obviously after that, I go to uh, Medic. And I see what I can get here. And I get, boom, strength, boom, health, and nothing. So those are my final stats before I re-record. When I re-record, I'll have drastically much better stats. I'm not going to tell you what I get, but they are fucking amazingly good. So... Stay tuned for set 12 of Final Fantasy 13. Brandon Goldstein wants to return for set 13. So anyway, stay tuned for some more Final Fantasy 13. I'm going to try to finish it before Christmas. So the next recording will be the beginning of set 12. And an amazing cutscene. My favorite in the entire game. So stay tuned for more Final Fantasy 13. After that, Deus Ex.